Russian ground controllers are continuing to monitor the uh, health and the flights of the vehicle. Everything is green, looking good. We're about uh, 18 minutes away from docking. It's the Soyuz drifting down toward the bottom of the screen. It's flying around continuing 17 minutes now until docking. How are you there? Good to have come. Now we're fine. Yes, we're great. Inaudible. Are you in DC? In we're in mm. MRM. About 200 meters between the Soyuz and the International Space Station. What this fly around is doing is basically swinging this vehicle up around the back end of the station and up on top of it. This poised module that they're going to be docking with actually points up towards space. It is directly across from the pier's docking compartment, which points down below. That is where the current Progress 52 is currently docked. And then the uh, Soyuz that brought up your cheek in Parmitano and Nyberg is docked basically next door, uh, pointing down toward the Earth below on the Rosvet module. So a busy time for the Russian segment with uh, all the ports being uh, occupied at this point. ATV is back there at the back on the uh, Zvezda service module. These two vehicles are currently uh, about to enter into orbital sunset in just a few minutes. So it will be uh, dark at the time of docking. But they're up over the uh, South Pacific Ocean right now, about to make a uh, northeastern swing up towards South America. And at the time the docking takes place, it should be just off the coast of uh, Peru and South America. I'm also trying to look at the display, too. Yes, we are within... We're almost uh, within docking. You see it probably the ground requested and you started the maneuver. We're going to approach the axis and start the approach. Um, we have uh, final approach, and we're moving along the axis. Uh, we started the maneuver. Uh, we don't have KSO right now. We have it back. We have come. Um, we can see the numbers, we can make out the numbers, but the picture is poor. Sorry, please provide, we do not have video coverage right now, but sorry, provide, uh, we've come. We have uh, completed the row maneuver uh, range. Uh, notable range rate is practically zero, and uh, we have the acquisition. Uh, 
пару подготовки и можно переходить к причем. Uh, you can transition to a uh, final uh, approach. Could you repeat it? Uh, could you please repeat it? Uh, prepare the headlights. Okay. I'm going to remove the AGC mode. We have the headlight ready. Yeah, Soyuz is currently station keeping away from the International Space Station a few hundred meters. Sending the final approach command. They're about to start final approach coming up here shortly. 53503. Do you have near range light on? Yes. Range 190, uh, range rate is uh, 048, uh, we are accelerating to approach, uh, status is without issues, copy. Parameters are without issues. Range is 166 and 048. 166 meters between the International Space Copy. Station and the Soyuz, the final approach underway now. 140 meters between the two vehicles. Looks like we're going to be docking slightly earlier than planned tonight. The two spacecraft still high above communications with uh, both vehicles. Range rate is zero five six. Yes, please report range and range range on a regular basis. We're currently trying to select the power to make it more visible. Well, um, we do not um, have the video right now. Nine five ninety five meters. Range rate zero four seven. Copy. Yeah, the hairs are in the center of Oiska. Oli Kotov, the commander of the Soyuz, reporting that. Uh, his docking target is in the middle of the crosshairs, as you would expect it to be. A little bit less than 90 meters between the two vehicles now. Soyuz moving in at 0.3 meters per second. According to the telemetry we're seeing, all the data looks nominal, no issues. Everything is good on our side as well. The crew reporting that everything going according to plan and uh, they're doing well. We're approaching slowly and steadily. Range is 60. Uh, the uh, target is, is practically in the center and we're approaching smoothly. We have 47 meters. Uh, SSMP activated. Range rate 018. 
So a tenth of a meter per second is the speed at which the Soyuz is closing in. They're about uh, 40 plus meters away right now. Range 45.45 and range rate 018. We have the um, Avocat closed. Message eliminated. That round circle you see there right above the crosshairs on the screen, that is the uh, docking hatch of the Poisk module. That is going to be this vehicle's home for the next five and a half months. Poisk sits there right in between the uh, Zvezda service module and the Zarya module. We see this thing. We're coming up on the uh, 15th anniversary of the launch of Zarya. Of course, that was the first piece of the International Space Station uh, ever launched back on November 20th of uh, 1998. Range, range zero, range rate zero one three. Uh, the target is in the center, and the crosshairs are aligned. Copy. Range 2525, range rate 013. Three. Copy. Three. Still easing in at a tenth of a meter per second, about 25 meters between the two vehicles. Range 20 to zero, range rate. One three. Scorch, Range rate nine. Twenty meters and nine. All eight. Right now, um, you're going to have um a little motion along the row angle. Okay. The target is in the center. Ah, uh, the crosshairs are aligned. Seventeen meters, zero one. So seventeen meters between the two vehicles again. Docking was planned for nine forty eight PM Central Time. It's gonna be slightly early. We'll have an official time once the two vehicles are uh, docked and secured to each other. Fifteen, one five meters. Ten meters, zero one two. The target is in the center. Crosshairs are aligned. Copy. Continue providing your voice commentary. Nine meters, zero one. Nine meters in closing. Standing by for contact and capture. The space station is currently 262 miles above the Pacific Ocean, just to the west of Peru. Seven meters, zero one. Ten meters, 
on zero one two. Target in the center, crosshair is aligned. Two meters. Zero one three. Everything is aligned in, in the center, no issues. We have uh, mechanical uh, contact. We have contact and capture confirmed at 9.45 p.m. Central Time with the space station 261 miles above the Pacific Ocean. Just to the west of Lima, Peru. Once again, contact and capture of the Soyuz carrying Oleg Kotov, Sergei Ryzansky, and Mike Hopkins at 9.45 p.m. Central Time, 10.45 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, master in indicator mode. That's great. 